Hey Capricorn of Sweet Joy, welcome to my channel. God bless you. Alright, today's video is about what you don't see in love. I have my little white dove here who represents, you know, salvation, I guess, or a new beginning. A way of thinking that was a pattern before and just like these patterns switching up. Okay, so thank you, bird. Alright. I should not grab him by the neck, but, oh well, please forgive me. Thank you. Here we go. Let's see what you don't see. And love Capricorn. All right. What you don't see in love. All right. Okay. What you don't see. Messages coming in that will go back and forth. Okay. I did a reading, actually. I did two videos for you before this one, and the same card came up, reversed, over and over. So what does that actually mean? Okay, the two of pentacles reverse. Letters of exchange. Making a decision, okay? Not one person sending something and the other person doesn't reciprocate. This is reciprocation, exchanges. Okay, emotions are in the air, money is in the air, and doing what you love is in the air. Okay, healing. Okay, looking to see what is important, what is the most important decision has been made or will be made, and this is coming. Okay, so that's what you don't see in love. What is the secret about this? You don't know. Number two is I know. What don't you know about love? Look at this in the big old hat. You don't know. Okay. What's the secret about what you don't know, Capricorn? You love. Hope you're having a wonderful day today. All right. Okay. So you're missing a tower moment with this decision. Okay. It's something that uh, was decided, will be decided, is discussed, some kind of message sent that will escape. Uh, Something that may cause you emotional distress or mess with your money or something you love or something that's important to you that you have your hands on right now. You don't know that, okay, in love. Okay, so let's see. What is the secret about that secret? The secret is you're missing a power moment. So you're avoiding a catastrophe, okay, with the exchange that's coming in. Now, because it's a pinnacle, it have, could have to do with money. Because his feet are green. Your stability with the ship. Your ability to float emotionally in and out. Okay. Ability. Well, what else does the ship? The ship is control over your life. Okay. So what is the secret behind this secret behind this secret? Okay. For Capricorn. What don't you see in love? You're missing the catastrophe. Some letters of exchange are coming in. You don't know this, but... It will help you avoid some trouble. What is the secret? And if you look at this, these people now are landing on their feet. Okay. I'm going to back this up again. But they're landing on their feet now. Okay. After something. So this is a happy thing. It's all for the good. Even though people have to surrender. Okay. On their perspective sides. What is the secret? One more secret about what you don't see in love, Capricorn. And I'm going to get some extra bonus cards. Exchange is coming in. Alright. Alright. So this pinnacle, this, this exchange coming in is an offer from God. It's coming out of some dark times, some cloudy times. There is a road to walk down. You see that? Okay. And then there is blue for attainment. Okay. And a sturdy big offer. This could be money. Whatever this is. Okay. Some decision coming in. Letters of exchange. It may be emotional, but it's all about money and love. Okay. One foot in, one foot out. You have to make a decision. Doing this will allow you to land on your feet. It seemed bad, but you're avoiding some other catastrophe. Okay, which was landing on your head. So with this, the secret about this, avoiding this, if you walk through this yellow brick road here, 
it'll lead you to attaining this Ace of Pentacles, which is a new start, a new beginning, a new stable offer, a new relationship, new health, new way of thinking, new beginning. Okay, so that's great. Wonderful. Now, in love, just say this is a new offer because these are all pinnacles. So this is about your life. Looking at it, okay? It looks like it's about your life. Let us see. What are the affirmations you should say every day? Dealing with this mess catastrophe, you're about to land on your feet. Just dealing with your life, okay? Or love, your love life. In love, what did you miss? Something you missed, and now you're getting something offered. So because you missed this catastrophe, you're about to land on your feet. Now it's time to relax, okay? She's sitting in her garden. Look at her. So pretty. Sitting in her garden. She's not tripping. See that? She got her lucky bunny rabbit, too. What is the affirmation after you miss this tower moment? I choose to relax. You see this? Even when you only see half the pinnacle. And you're one foot in, one foot out. So it haven't happened already, but it's coming out of the clouds. This is fertile. I choose to relax and not to fill my mind with worry as that creates stress. So if, it, if it's even on, look, you may just have one foot. You just might now be surrendering. You see? And your feet just now going towards the ground. Still, things are halfway. You feel me? Halfway. Still relax. God got your back, baby. It's fertile. It'll be a new great offer. And see how that just matches? See? Now, first it was a two of pentacles reverse. Messages. Now it's two aces. If you, you know, from one, you thought it was a loss, or making this decision will bring the biggest ship for you and bring something into your hand from God. And then you'll be sitting relaxed in this garden in the future. That is what. That is what it is. I'm telling you. What attitude should you have? Dealing with love. You should relax. It says, I am uplifted and energized. Okay. So after you relax and get up, and you'll be energized after this rest period. You need to relax and don't worry. You're only halfway there. Okay. Now I wanted to get into... That is what you don't see in love. You need to relax. Let's move this. You have two pinnacles there. One is in the air, but in the real world, it's offered by God. And then there you are relaxing for the future. What do the sacred ones have to tell you? People have what? Passed on angels, sacred ones. What do the sacred ones have to tell you? Set your sides higher, okay, for these new beginnings. So maybe you were didn't think you could have all that you can. So this is a little boat. Set your sides higher for the biggest boat, okay, really, right? You're going to have to set your sides higher knowing that you deserve it. And then you have star ancestor, follow the voice of your soul, okay? Dealing with this secret new beginning, new start. And this is dealing with where you walk, where your feet. Now, when you follow the voice of your soul, your soul is talking directly to you. Sorry about that. Okay. And as you can see, when you when your soul talks to you about this new beginning, this new start, walking through this for attainment, where your feet will go, the little boat versus the big boat. You have to set your sights higher, follow your soul or your dreams, your inner self. Oh, man. Yeah, and don't fall over. Please forgive me. See how his feet may, may, may be afraid to fall, so he, they got your back. All right. And even though that happened, I'm still keeping the video. It's too good to be true, right? Because you're going to get out of this. We gotta get what angel set your sights higher. So whatever the present situation is, it'll be better. That's why you have a road to walk down. And as you can see, everything's talking about the air. 
So this is your thoughts. We're bringing your reality, your dreams, and the angels are watching you. So look at the stars at night. You might get some signs or synchronicities. One more. What angels working with Capricorn? It says healthy choices right now. Thank you, angels, for guiding me to make healthy decisions. So remember we were talking about the two of pentacles of decision and exchanges, talking about this decision. Set your size higher and to make the healthy choices concerning the decisions for this new start, new beginning. And the last card. If you said this is, has to do with this one, if you set your sights higher. Okay. If you make healthy choices, then you'll be uplifted. You see, this is going in together. This will be our last card of the day. Follow the voice of your soul to be uplifted and energized for this new beginning and make healthy choices. What is the recovery card I want to say before you go? This is what you don't see, what you should do, your advice. What is the advice for Capricorn, what you don't see in love? Conscious breathing. Hmm. Your breath is your life force. It is both energizing and relaxing. What? And the relax card is here? Let's bring it out. There she goes for this new beginning. Nice. Conscious breaths. Look at me. Huh? Conscious breaths help you relax and bring you back to the present moment. Conscious breathing is a simple and spiritual exercise to help you relax healthy choices. What? And to simply let go. Take a few minutes every day to connect to your breathing. Sit quietly with your feet on the floor. Slowly inhale and then exhale even more slowly. Do this several times a day. Stay connected to your inhaling and exhaling breath. Feel the immediate relaxation that comes from the breath. Release any fear or anxiety. Reciting a word like relax or peace will help to keep distracting thoughts to a minimum. Especially when people get on your nerves, right? It's easy to do. Take this card that encourages you to breathe in and out and let go. I am breathing with conscious awareness, releasing tension and stress. This is your affirmation to get to this new beginning. Relaxing to release stress, okay? Dang, come on up. There you go. I hope you can see that and you can't. Relax with conscious breathing. All right. I okay, ain't rid of this light bear thing. All right. So thank you, Capricorn. Sorry about the technical difficulties. You know I love you. This is what you don't know. You got some messages coming in or decisions will be made, okay? But it will be in your best interest. Whatever it is. The decision you will make, you'll make the right one, and it'll lead to money, lead a road to fertility, a stable new beginning for you. So stay uplifted and energized, make healthy choices, relax. You may be only halfway there and you can't see everything, but as long as you're zen and grounding yourself with conscious breaths, relaxing, it'll the, the feet will lead you right to green fertility and emotional stability with a big boat. Not the little baby one, okay? Let God take you where you're supposed to be, having faith, okay? Because you, you relax when you have faith. I love you so much, Capricorn. Take care. I am Dr. Sweet Joy on YouTube. Like, share, and subscribe. Don't forget to hit the notification bell. Talk to you later. God bless you. Bye.